Hello, I hope you guys are all doing great. This is the nail art design we'll be working on today. Let's get started. The first thing to do is choose a background color of your choice. The one I'm using is this lavender color by Revlon and it's called Gumdrop. Once your nail polish completely dries, you're going to need a black and white color. So you can go in and paint those stripes. You're also going to need a striper brush. I don't have a size for this one, but you should be able to find something similar in your local beauty supply store. I'm going to begin on the side and I'm just painting a white stripe coming alongside the nail. Okay, go all the way across. Above this stripe, I'm going to be painting another white stripe coming across the nail. In total, I'm going to be painting three stripes. Now coming in sideways the opposite direction, I'll be painting a couple of white stripes as well. Now using the same striper brush, we're going to be painting a black stripe going in between the, the white little squares we just made, the white little stripes. So I'm just going to continue doing that until I get to the other side. Now I'm going to be crossing with the black paint going across. This is the pattern I have over all of my nails except for my thumbnail and my ring finger nail. For the sake of the video so I don't have to remove the pattern, I'm going to be painting the flower on top of the pattern, but it's not necessary. If you're going to be um, painting your flower then you don't need to paint the pattern over your thumbnail or your ring finger nail. So now we're just going to move over to painting the flower. This is the brush brand and size I'm going to be using to paint my flower and this is what the tip looks like. I'm going to begin by painting the first flower petal and I'm making it bigger than probably the rest of them. So there you can see a really big white flower petal. I'm going to move to the side and this one's going to be coming in sideways. Also a big flower petal, but it's not coming under the, the pattern. It's staying within those lines. Now I'm going to come up a little bit higher over this way and I'm going to do the same thing. It's also going to be a big flower petal, but also not coming out of the patterns, little square patterns. Now these following two that I'm going to paint are going to have to be smaller. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to touch it and just pretending that the flower continues just ending it there. And what, every time I use white for some reason, it just doesn't show very well what I'm doing. but. This one's going to be able to be a little bit longer, but also not all the way, covering all the way. So that's what we have there so far. Now I'm just going to allow this to dry. Using a lavender color, I'm going to be painting the very center coming outward towards the leaves. Using a really tiny tip brush, this is actually a liner brush, I'm just going to go in and paint a couple of tiny, tiny little dots just to add detail to the flower. And I'm going to be doing that starting from in the corner of the flower petals and then coming in a little bit towards where we painted the black little stripes. So I'm just going to continue doing that to all the flower petals. Thank you. 
using a small size dotting tool, I'm just going to be painting a little pattern coming down alongside the nail and I'm going to do the same thing over the top area. I'm going to apply top coat over my flower and I'm going to be placing a 3mm size crystal in the center of my flower. All you have left to do is to apply your top coat sealing in your design. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and try out this nail art design using your favorite colors. Be safe and I'll see you next time. Bye!